I need those highlights. Game three, Cubs, D-backs, Jordan Wicks out there on the hill, and Cattell Marte, this dude never sleeps, Joe. Did he leave the yard again? He did. And he how did. do you homer on the last pitch you see the night before and, and the, first the first pitch, pitch. you see? One left-handed, one right-handed. Yeah, Cattell Marte, my man's out there swinging a boat paddle. One zip snakes. Eugenio Suarez with a runner on third. Nico Horner uh, deep in the hole. Skipping that one across to get the out. Yeah, outstanding defense today, and Morrell had an outstanding play today, and that's an outstanding play by Nico as well. Yeah, he throws absolute gas. Christopher Morrell does, but Horner at first, talk at the plate. Talkman uh, doubling to right. Here comes Nico once again, head on a swivel, and you love to see hustle just like this. Yeah, Nico read that ball extremely well, got to second as it hit the wall and was able to score. And then Jan Gomes, he contributes. He was 0 for 5 off of fought before he, when he came into this game, but he had a big hit here, and it put the Cubs up 2-1. to one. That's right. The rain must fall. Yanni chipping in on this one to make it a 2-1 ball game. Then bottom five, Jordan Wick still out there. Cattell Marte. Cattell, go on vacation. Just find a way to get him out of there. Yeah. Yeah, Next he, time you come into town, just go on vacation. Uh-huh. I heard St. Croix is lovely this time of year. <laughs> Arizona, they tied up 2-2, and Jordan Wick's day would be done. Top six, Cody Bellinger. He said that he was going to get himself a hit, but you didn't say he was going to go bridge, and that is what we saw, Joe. Well, Dwight Smith used to say inside yank it, down the middle crank it, that's outside spank it, hang it, bang it. And that's exactly what he did. He gave him a hanging breaking ball, that little sweeper, and Cody got it. And Cody added some extra runs later on with an RBI single. But Cody had a good day. He, he swung the bat extremely well yesterday and wasn't rewarded for it. He was today. Yeah, some loud outs like we talked about. Uh, Cubs up 3-2, top of the eighth. Dan's beyond second. Cody again. This is just lending credence to the Cubs being good with runners in scoring position today. They batted 500, Joe. They were three for six. Yeah, I, I would ask you, is your wedge that good? Can you direct it that well? Because he did a really good job, and they took the extra base on the bad throw by Suarez. Yeah, I have had the same sandwich since I was 14 years old, but that's another story for another day. Right now, we're talking about Michael Bush and his ability to change games, Joe. I love seeing him getting at bats off of left-handers because if he proves that he can hit left-handers, he will be the everyday first baseman because he swung it so well off of right-handers. And there's Hayden. Ooh, Oof, that's yeah. a nice breaking ball right there. Yeah, that case. That's what kept me up at night. Those when I was hitting. Right okay. There. Yeah. Because I was Jason. Suarez, they won't sleep a wink tonight. Now, Wisniewski, he was pulled. Drew Smiley, he was the next man up. And Jock Peterson said, I know him. I know him well. And that pitch right there is right in my wheelhouse. It was gone. Well, I hadn't homered um, before yesterday. Uh, hit his first yesterday and his second today. But Drew Smiley bounces back, gets two outs finishes it up with the ground ball to Michael Bush, and the Cubs take another series. I mean, five and four on the West Coast, that is really hard to do. That's a great road trip. Especially after taking on uh, the Texas Rangers to get the season started, then Colorado, and then the Los Angeles Dodgers at home. They're now 11 and seven, so you can't feel too shabby about the way things have gone as of late, right? And they were facing good teams, too. They faced the Padres, the Mariners, and obviously Arizona, who was in the World Series last year. So. This was not an easy road trip. It's out of the way, which is fantastic. You got one of the West Coast trips out of the way. Five and four, great trip.